So guys, if you do want to get your hands on some FIFA coins, make sure to go check out fifacoin.com. You're going to get the cheapest, most reliable and best service of FIFA coins. And I'm also getting you guys a 5% discount. So make sure to go check them out, but enjoy the video. What is going on guys? If you are new around here, make sure to subscribe. Of course, drop a like down below if you do enjoy. And if you want to be in for the chance of getting involved in any of the giveaways, you're going to need to be subbed. So make sure to do that. If you do want to earn some extra coins and get some investments, of course, we do have the Discord. So drop me a message over on Instagram if you are interested. But without further ado, guys, let's get into it. So we're going to start off with one that's going to make you a ton of coins right now. We've got Gold Rare, Liga, Than Tan Liga Santander, I can't even speak, Liga Santander, and we're going to go for Sofia Defenders. Now, realistically, you've got quite a few decent players. You've got Navas, Akuna, Kunde, um, so you've got quite a nice selection. You've even got there, got Carlos there as well. So actually, as a set of players, it's brilliant for a sniping filter. So looking at it right now, we're looking at over 4K for the cheapest player, uh, or around that mark. So we're looking at 3.7, even one right now, the 70 rated is pretty expensive expensive so if we knock this down to the cheapest it can be we've got 3.5 there let's have a look 3.6 just seeing where we're going to be buying these guys at um, i think that 3.5 might actually be a sniper we're going to list it at 3.9 i think would be the point uh, and then we'll work out EA tax in a moment. Uh, but as I say, it's a really, really simple method. So looking at it, 3.7, uh, you've got a couple Kundes there, uh, and then you've got a couple Montiels. So realistically, we're gonna sell on at 3.8 or 3.9. Now EA tax is around 200 coins on them. So if you take off 200, it brings you to, <laughs> to there. 200 again brings you to 3.5, which is what we purchased. So that's actually not too bad at all. Now, if we snipe at 3.4, we're gonna be on a little bit of a safer path just to make sure that we don't lose any coins if players go up or down in price. So we're gonna do that. But this one is really simple, makes you a ton of coins, and it's probably one of the better methods out there right now. Um, there's quite a lot in terms of methods that are reasonably good at certain times or certain SPCs come out, but this one is pretty solid consistently. Um, you've got all of the players coming in at around the similar value so because of that as well and um, you've got a much bigger chance of sniping now that was an absolutely unfortunate miss there 750 for a diego carlos would have been about a 3.1k profit i think <laughs> so i guess actually no it's a bit like 3.4 3 more like so actually that's a pretty big l but you win some you lose some will take it hopefully and uh, we can get one to make up for it. Right, we'll do a couple more snipes. Obviously, I am coughing a little bit still. I don't know if you guys may have noticed, I am still a little bit ill. I'm not as ill as I was. I went on holiday with my work and basically 30 or 40 of us ended up being sick from it. So. I don't know what the hell that was. And we're actually going to be looking at a little bit more of a higher budget filter. We're looking at the Rodri's and the Laporte's over at the one sort of 19k mark, I guess. Let's have a look. 18k there. Um, obviously, with these kind of players, we, we do EA tax and we just take off 10%. So we literally do 18,500. So we'll take off 10%, which is 1,850. So we take off a K. Uh, that'll be. 750 so we take there and uh, the reason we do that is because over 10k i just like to make sure that we're getting like a minimum of a k profit per card so this one here is comfortably just over a k per card now with this one you've got laporte you've got rodri hopefully one or two come up now as usual we're sniping at 12.45 now i will start fixing up the timing i'm recording videos just so that we've got a better chance of maybe getting some good snipes in there i'm going to try and maybe record as i get home from work rather than before i go to bed um, but right now we're here hopefully we can get one or two obviously if we can get a compare price on one at you know 17 750 that'd be great we're literally you know going for 16 500 and below so it is a little bit of a push we are going to have to work hard for this one but i reckon we can get one or two um or Maybe just the one, um, we'll have to see. Is that one even still there? <coughs> when you're doing compare price and there's only one card, you've got to back out every now and then just to make sure the card is still on the market. We'll go to 16,750, it reduces the profit just below okay. We could do 17, uh, but I don't want to risk it, but we're just gonna see if we can get one. Now, obviously, they're not as likely to come up, especially at night, and, and I am definitely picking poor timings for these, but it's a very decent filter for getting Rodri and Laporte. But we're going to go back in and have a go at another one. Going back in, we're going to have a look at one a little bit more simple. We're just going to go Spanish, Gold, Rare, and center back, and we're going to be looking at let's have a look. Uh, we've got the likes of Aspi, Sergio, uh, Mario, Laporte. You've got quite a few people here. Uh, we're going to be looking, I think, probably at around 4K. Let's have a look. 
What a guess. I say a guess. I've obviously just helped tested the filters before the video, but uh, what a semi guess. So let's have a look. 3.2. Uh, let's have a look. So, uh, okay, they're more like the 3K mark then. What? So guys, today I'm bringing you the best sponsorship we've ever had on the channel. It's Pro Jersey Official, and I wouldn't interrupt the video for just any reason. First of all, we have some of the best football shirts you can get on the market at a much better price than you'll buy them from the retailers. First of all, as you can see, we've got the nicest football kit of the season, the white PSG kit. We've also got 24 on the back, which my birthday's 24th of March. If you want to support me, support the sponsors and also of course subscribe next we've literally got one of the rarest football kits of all of the season the ix bob marley kit but if you guys want to get these or any other football jerseys or any kits of your choosing go check out pro jersey official use the code pro recoil for 10 percent off and remember i am wearing these in pretty much every video from now the only reason i've got this one is because i've just came back from boxing training but make sure to go check these guys out subscribe and give them a follow and let's get into the video. Let's have a look. So, 3K, uh, I'd say, is a guaranteed sell on. There's quite a few at 3K, though. Um, so, you've got to be a little bit careful there. We probably want to pick up at 2.7. It means at 3K, we're getting a 150 coin profit per card. Now, I do have two more filters for your faces today, guys. I'm, I'm being generous. I'm going to give you five. So, if you are new around here, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe. Um, if you're in the Discord, drop a comment down below. Let everyone know what you think. We have had pretty much everyone turn to a year member so far, so if you are interested, make sure to let us know and we'll get you involved. Because um, it is running really well and we are really happy with the results of it at the minute. Um, so if you are interested in getting a little bit of extra coinage and you don't want to spend money on FIFA points or FIFA coins, come over to the Discord, we'll get you sorted and get you uh, as many coins as we can. Obviously, if you've got 100k, we'll get you 200, 300, 400. If you've got a mil, then we'll get you a few million coins. It is obviously based on what you start with, uh, but we can build you up to a million and then go from there. So uh, make sure, if you are interested, to uh, to check that out. Obviously, it does seem like this filler just doesn't seem to want to give any cards out at all. Um, so I am a bit weary of the fact that we're being scammed here by EA. Uh, is it going to kick me out of the filter? No, it's not kicking me out of the filter. It has kicked me out of the filter. <laughs> and back in, we're going to be looking at a little bit more of a simple filter. We're looking at Portugal foot birthdays. Now, you've got Ruben Vezo and Guerrero coming up mostly. Now, you will obviously get the likes of Mendes in there. Realistically, uh, I'm not suggesting you snipe him is going to be very much you know likely whether he's going to come up or anything and um, it would be nice if he did but obviously he's a little bit more expensive and obviously we're not doing this as a ronaldo filter let's be realistic so we want to do obviously 10 percent. so ea tax it's about 35k so 10 percent 3k plus 500 and that's where we're safely sniping now are we going to get one at this time i do not know we're still going to try and we're still going to pop out one more filter after but i do reckon because they're so easily packable there's a good chance someone gets a vezo in this setup so hopefully we get someone who doesn't want to make too many coins i i've got i'm envisioning like a 25k i could see someone listing it really dumb and we'll get in a massive snipe and then me being very very gassed so that's what I'm hoping for. Whether that comes to fruition, I don't know. We'll, we'll do a 32K. It, it does lose us a little bit of profit, but I'm hopeful, I'm hopeful. We'll, we'll do, I don't wanna do a 15 count so early. Right, we'll do a 15 count. So 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Right, we're gonna call it a day on that filter. The thing we're gonna be looking at is Dutch League Silvers. Now these guys, are a little bit on the cheaper end of things, but you can pick them up really, really cheaply and make a decent amount. So if we go at 400, we've got that one there, Namali, and you wanna list them up for 600. You're basically just listing all of them up for 600 coins. Picking them up anything 400 and below is, is kind of the way to go with this one. Now, the reason I'm mentioning this method is because you can do it as a bidding filter. So you wanna set the maximum price to probably 250, I'd say is probably the best way to go. So 250, uh, 250 we'll go along here see some that aren't bidded on because if we get like 10 of these and we sell them all at 600 you're pretty much doubling or more than doubling your coins on every card now obviously you don't want to mistakenly buy any because that is a massive finesse when that happens 
but we can get a good page as well for players. Um, we'll load it again, move a few pages down. We don't obviously want to go for the same ones, so let's have a look. Obviously, you've got to bear in mind as well, some of these players are going to go for more than 600 coins. Some of them uh, will be slightly less, but overall, we're just going to make a ton of profit. You won't lose coins. Uh, at worst case scenario, you'll sell them off for like 400. It is a pretty foolproof method. So we're going to put a few more down just because we can get some of these ones while people are asleep. Right, that is the end of the video. I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you tomorrow.